Imagine a hidden world, larger than India, yet unseen to the naked eye. This is Zealandia, an almost entirely submerged landmass that lurks beneath the southwest Pacific Ocean, covering an expansive area of around 2 million square miles. The land that once belonged to this massive expanse is now reduced to a few islands, including New Zealand and New Caledonia, while the rest remains shrouded beneath the ocean waves. Zealandia's story is a remarkable journey through time. Around 23 million years ago, this continental fragment decided to part ways with Antarctica. What ensued was a slow but dramatic process that saw the majority of Zealandia slide gracefully beneath the surface of the sea. But Zealandia is no ordinary piece of Earth's crust. Unlike the thinner, denser oceanic crust that forms the seabed, Zealandia is made up of thicker, less dense continental crust. Unraveling the mysteries of Zealandia requires a bit of geological detective work. Scientists have combed through various forms of evidence to learn more about this elusive landmass. Satellite images of Earth have revealed the submerged boundaries of Zealandia, showcasing a clear distinction from the surrounding oceanic crust. Rock samples dredged up from the deep tell tales of a land once dry and solid, now lying beneath the waves. But why does Zealandia matter? Apart from its staggering size, this sunken continent provides invaluable insights into the processes of plate tectonics, the movement of Earth's giant crustal plates, and the mysteries of continental drift. Understanding Zealandia's past helps scientists piece together the complex puzzle of our planet's geological history. This hidden continent also hosts a rich biodiversity, both above and below the water. The islands that remain above sea level are home to unique flora and fauna, some of which cannot be found anywhere else on Earth. Below the waves, the submerged parts of Zealandia provide habitats for a myriad of marine species, contributing to the rich tapestry of life in the Pacific Ocean. Enveloped by the warm, tropical waters of Southeast Asia lies an ancient realm largely unknown to the wider world, Sunderland. This vast submerged landmass, stretching from the Malay Peninsula all the way to the islands of Borneo and Java, is a submerged wonder concealing tales of a land that once was. Sunderland during the last ice age was not the archipelago we recognize today, but rather a contiguous expanse of land engulfed by lush rainforests and teeming with unique wildlife. The drastic change in sea levels resulting from the melting of the Ice Age glaciers transformed this once vast peninsula into the fragmented landscapes we see today. The remnants of this extensive landmass are now known as the Sunda Shelf, a shallow sea platform that gives scientists a peek into a world lost to time. Geological and biological evidence have been paramount in uncovering the secrets of Sunderland, the distribution of flora and fauna across the islands of Southeast Asia bears silent testimony to a time when these lands were united. Species that are isolated by sea share genetic similarities, indicating a common ancestry dating back to when these areas were interconnected. Furthermore, sedimentary layers and fossil records provide clues to the dramatic environmental transformations Sunderland has undergone. One of the intriguing aspects of Sunderland is its potential role in human prehistory. Archaeological findings suggest that this region could have been a pivotal pathway for early human migration. The now submerged land bridges would have provided ancient humans with a terrestrial route from mainland Asia to the islands, facilitating the spread of both people and culture across the region. Beyond its historical and biological significance, Sunderland also holds a sense of mystique and allure, Local legends and folklore speak of ancient civilizations and lost cities hidden beneath the waves, captivating the imagination of explorers and researchers alike. While many of these tales remain unverified, they add an intriguing layer to the enigma of Sunderland. Nestled between the shores of modern-day United Kingdom and continental Europe lies the sunken world of Doggerland, a once sprawling and vibrant land bridge that connected the two regions during the last ice age. Today, its remnants rest beneath the chilly waves of the North Sea, capturing the imagination of archaeologists, historians, and adventure seekers alike. Doggerland's existence was drastically altered by the end of the last ice age, approximately 8,000 years ago. As the massive glaciers melted, sea levels rose, swallowing up the vast expanses of land and transforming the geography of Europe as we know it. Doggerland, once a rich habitat for both humans and wildlife, gradually became submerged, leaving behind a treasure trove of secrets beneath the sea. 
archaeological discoveries have begun to peel back the layers of this hidden world, providing tantalizing glimpses into the lives of its ancient inhabitants. Traces of human activity, such as tools, weapons, and even remnants of dwellings, have been unearthed, painting a picture of a once thriving civilization. These discoveries suggest that Doggerland was not just a transient space for nomadic tribes, but a permanent home for communities that lived, worked, and thrived in this lush landscape. The environment of Doggerland was dramatically different from the barren seabed that exists today. During its time, it was a rich mosaic of rivers, lakes, marshlands and hills, teeming with flora and fauna. Fossil evidence indicates a variety of wildlife, ranging from large mammals such as mammoths and rhinoceroses to an abundance of fish and birds. This diverse ecosystem not only provided ample resources for the human inhabitants, but also made Doggerland a crucial corridor for animal migrations. As the waters rose and Doggerland disappeared beneath the waves, its stories were not completely lost. The land's gradual submersion left behind layers of sediment that have preserved the remnants of this ancient world. Modern technology, such as sonar scanning and underwater archaeology, has allowed scientists to map out the lost landscapes of Doggerland, providing a fascinating window into our prehistoric past. In addition to its archaeological and historical significance, Doggerland also holds a special place in folklore and mythology. Some researchers speculate that tales of sunken kingdoms and lost lands, such as Atlantis, may have their roots in the real-life disappearance of Doggerland, these stories, passed down through generations, serve as a poignant reminder of the transient nature of our world and the powerful forces that shape our planet's history. Tucked away between the easternmost tips of Asia and the western edges of North America, the submerged landmass known as Beringia paints a fascinating picture of our planet's history. This hidden expanse, now mostly submerged beneath the Bering Strait, was once a vital bridge connecting two continents, playing a pivotal role in the migration of humans and animals. Dating back to the Pleistocene era, Beringia stretches across what is now the Chukchi Sea, the Bering Sea and parts of the Arctic Ocean. Unlike the other land bridges that vanished beneath rising sea levels after the last ice age, Beringia's transformation was unique. The area experienced fluctuations in sea levels, leading to periods of exposure and submersion, creating a dynamic landscape that shaped the course of evolution and migration in the region. When Beringia was exposed, it wasn't just a narrow bridge, but a vast plain, spanning thousands of miles rich in biodiversity. The environment was characterized by tundra and steppe vegetation, providing a habitat for a variety of Pleistocene megafauna. Woolly mammoths, giant bison, and saber-toothed cats roamed the landscape, while smaller mammals, birds, and plant life created a robust ecosystem. Human inhabitants were not left out of this natural abundance. Archaeological findings have unearthed evidence of ancient civilizations that once called Beringia home. These early settlers were part of a migratory wave from Asia to North America, taking advantage of the land bridge to explore new territories. The archaeological artifacts left behind, including tools and remnants of dwellings, offer a glimpse into the lives and ingenuity of these early inhabitants. Beringia's significance extends beyond its role in migration. The unique conditions of the region contributed to the phenomenon known as the Beringian Standstill, where a population of humans became genetically isolated for several thousand years. This isolation led to genetic adaptations and diversity that are still present in the indigenous peoples of the Americas today. The allure of Beringia is not just confined to its historical and archaeological treasures. The mysteries of this submerged world have also captured the imagination of scientists and storytellers alike. Tales of ancient civilizations and lost worlds abound, with Beringia often featured as a backdrop for adventure and exploration. Lying hidden beneath the turquoise waters of the Indian Ocean, Mauritia is a submerged fragment of the ancient world, enveloped in mystery and intrigue. This long-lost microcontinent, spanning millions of years of geological history, serves as a captivating subject of study for scientists and a fertile ground for imagination. Mauritius's story begins around 85 million years ago, when it is believed to have been part of the supercontinent Gondwana. Over time, as tectonic plates shifted and drifted apart, Mauritius found itself caught in the grand dance of continental drift. This resulted in its isolation and eventual submersion beneath the waves, 
leaving behind tantalizing clues about its existence. The discovery of zircon grains on the beaches of Mauritius served as the initial breadcrumb leading scientists to the Trail of Mauritius. These zircon crystals, dating back to around 2,000 to 3,000 million years, stood in stark contrast to the much younger volcanic rocks forming the island. The presence of such ancient minerals hinted at the existence of a much older landmass lurking beneath. Research and seismic studies further supported the theory of Mauritius' existence, painting a picture of a fragment spanning about 700 by 1900 kilometers. What remains of this submerged continent is now nestled between the Seychelles and Mauritius, silently holding stories of a bygone era. Mauritius' submerged status has also ignited interest in the realm of biodiversity. The unique geological conditions have created an underwater habitat that is both diverse and unique, housing marine species that have adapted to this hidden world. Studies suggest that the submerged landmasses like Mauritius may play a crucial role in the distribution of marine life across the Indian Ocean. The allure of Mauritius extends beyond its geological and biological significance. The concept of a lost continent hidden beneath the waves stirs the imagination and has given rise to numerous myths, legends and speculative theories. Some have even ventured to suggest connections between Mauritius and the fabled lost continent of Lemuria, although these claims remain in the realm of speculation. For scientists, the discovery and study of Mauritius offer a rare glimpse into the dynamic processes shaping our planet. The microcontinent's journey from a piece of Gondwana to its current submerged state serves as a testament to the relentless forces of nature and the ever-changing face of the Earth. As exploration and research continue, Mauritius stands as a beacon in the dark, inviting us to delve deeper, unravel its secrets, and uncover the stories etched into the very fabric of the Earth. In the heart of the Indian Ocean, the mysterious Mauritius lies in wait a submerged relic of an ancient world, whispering tales of times long past and secrets yet to be revealed. And as always, we hope you enjoyed our video today. Thanks for watching.